That's the last race that I'm bringing you in week one of the National Hunt Racing. Hope you've enjoyed them. This uh, final race is a two mile one furlong maiden chase. Number one, Goldeniev System for Hems. Edge for Freeze for T. Rogers, number two. Fiorente for Paul Rhodes, number three. Friday Girl, number four for Jim Murray. And number five is The Magician for Joshua Sutherland. Harry Cobden on board the nine to two favourite. So it's a small field, but some of the powerhouse stables represented here. Two mile, one furlong to go as they come to the first fence quite quickly. And Goldeniev's system took it off, uh, took off at that flight in the lead, but was quickly passed upon landing by the magician, who's just on the inside of that one as they go over the next. And the leading pair was slightly more fluent at that one than Fiorente, who's now been passed by Jim Murray's Friday Girl. And that one now takes up the lead. But it's still only a few lengths back to the back marker that is currently edge for freeze as they go over the water jump there all all of them over that one safely and head to head in the lead is the magician who just edges on now ever so slightly ahead of friday girl as they start swinging left-handed here it's the magician now joined again by friday girl to and in thrown at the front there those two as they start going downhill tracked in there and third by fiorente golden Yev system and last but not least, Edge 4 Freeze. And they all get over that one safely. It's been a good round of jumping so far. After they've jumped four flights of the 13 here at Newbury. So 11 and a half furlongs left to go. And the Magician has now surrendered that lead and doesn't want to go head to head with Friday Girl anymore. But the Magician didn't put in a particularly good jump there. Very high. In the air, a lot of air time, but not quite as quick a jump as Golden Yev System, the black horse on the outside of that one. Fiorente is on the inside on the rail. Much better jump there from the Magician, and that one is can't decide to the jockey whether he does want to go up alongside Friday Girl or not. But Harry Cobden's just tugged on the reins there and pulled it back to just sit there in behind the pace alongside Golden Yev System. The Magician has put in two wonderful leaps at the last two fences, but again. Harry Cobden doesn't want it to go to the front again and is just going to allow Friday Girl to bowl along in front here and set quite a nice pace as they come into that, that next, next fence. Golden Yev System almost got in too tight to that one, but the horse got the jockey out of trouble there. Edge 4 Freeze is one that's been pushed along a little bit, niggled a few times at the back of the field there. It's perhaps struggling to keep up with this pace and some of these horses that are galloping is a real good gallop here friday girl still moving along very smoothly traveling really well out in front for jim murray There's a couple of lengths lead to the magician in second place those black and red hoops for joshua sutherland as they come to that next flight really good jump from the second and third horses there and you can see that they quickly moved up right alongside friday girl so at the moment you would say that the most likely challenges are going to be this front three but the Magician and Golden Yev system particularly travelling really powerfully as Friday Girl, the jockey, just gets to work on that one. Wants it to start stretching these out, wants to build a bit of a lead as we come towards the final few flights. But a really good jump there from Friday Girl and it now is applying the pressure and it really is laying down this challenge, setting a good marker here as it goes over the next. But it got in too close to that one and that one has allowed the Magician and Golden Yev system to close. Fiorente is trying to get involved as well but Friday Girl really gamely out the back of each fence is just kicking on and opening up a couple of lengths but a, a commentator curse there slower jump and that's allowed golden yev system and fiorente to come up alongside friday girl the long time leader has now finally surrendered that lead to golden yev system and just as golden yev system came up on the outside and put the pressure on friday girl floundered at that one and golden yev girl as we go into the final furlong looks to be cruising the line little look over the right shoulder and the jockey just keeping it up keeping up the work there but really is being eased down and just just pushed out for a few strides there to maintain the advantage but we didn't need to see the best of golden yev system came up really powerfully on the outside jumped really well throughout and put the race to bed in a matter of strides and won very comfortably from fiorente in the end the other four to one joint favorite friday girl did stay on and managed to hold on to third place and in fourth place is the magician for Joshua Sutherland who was traveling powerfully as they came around the final bend but didn't just didn't kick on the way the others did so it's another winner for Craig Allen over the jumps Golden Yev system I'm sure we're going to see that in some really big two mile chase races over the season and completing and rounding off the four the five albeit a distance behind was edge four freeze for T Rogers